Hey everybody, how's everybody doing? Hope everybody's well. I've been away for a week or so and uh, wanted to come back and just do a short video on a few things here. So um, what I want to show you today is this wireless audio receiver. It's model HK009 and it's basically a Bluetooth receiver. And you'll notice that I have it connected into the back of my AM transmitter. And um, I have it paired with my Macintosh computer and my cell phone. And what you could basically do is stream music or anything you want through the transmitter to a radio. So let's take a look at my radio here. Turn it on. Let's see what we hear. There for me. Anyway, moving right along here. Let's get these uh, uh, push buttons out and see what they look like. They've been soaking for a couple of days now. Sounds like our friend John from Arkansas. Not a lick of rust at all on that. Oh, that looks good. It's still dirty. Now this stuff won't take off dirt, but it sure does. <coughs> Let's go take a look at the computer and see how you set it up. Okay, so there's John's video, and um, you can see it's playing, so we're going to hit stop on that. And I use a Macintosh, and the way that you do this with the Macintosh is by using iTunes. And right here is where you select your audio device. And you'll see right there it says HK009. So I'm connected to that device on the back of that transmitter. And if I play one of these songs, it's going to play on the transmitter. I could I could stack up songs forever. Okay, friends. Um, for my next video series, I want to let you choose what you want to see. Um, I think it's important. I've got three different things to show you, and um, you know I want to know what you're interested in. You've all done this stuff before, so it's probably boring. But if there's something that interests you, put it in the comment field, and I'll work on that and create a small little series out of it. So the first thing you're looking at is a Halicrafters model 5R41. And uh, it's a radio made by Halicrafters Continental. And you'll see that it's a uh, standard broadcast, and uh, it looks like it's got shortwave. Um, and it's in relatively good shape. Uh, the Tolex is in very good shape, actually. And it's got a leather handle. And if you flip it around, um, the chassis itself looks really good. What you may not be able to see very clearly is that it looks like someone was screwing around with the filter cap. There's just wires hanging in the breeze here. So I haven't taken it out of the chassis yet to look underneath. But it looks like someone was goofing around with this thing, so I'm going to have to be really careful. But it does look like it's made well, and it's got 9-pin uh, mini miniature tubes. And um, that's the first one, and it's, again, solid as can be. You know, Halicrafters make some good stuff there. So that's the first device, <clears throat> and um, here's the, uh, the chart that comes with it. It's also a battery operated radio, which is interesting. And uh, there's the tube line up, if you can see it. It's a little small. Anyway, that's that. Let me show you the next one. Be right back. The next one is a Philco 50 524. It's a, um, it's a standard broadcast radio, typical Philco unit. Um, you'll see that this one is in fairly bad shape. The cabinet looks okay, but the dial glass is shot, that type of thing. Um, I've already taken the uh, chassis out to take a look at it, and I've got it in there backwards right now. Um, but you'll see it's got, you know, it's got eight pin tubes in there. Um, the speaker's in great shape, and uh, this is going to need a complete restore. Underneath is all old wax caps, resistors that are out of tolerance, that type of thing. Um, so this will be a full restore. <clears throat> and this goes along with my promise. Whenever I ruin a radio, like I did with my AM transmitter, I'm going to re restore another one to make up for it. So that's what this one is. And um, this is a choice. And, you know, you've all seen radios before, so nothing special here. And then let me show you uh, what the last choice is. Be right back. Okay, and the last one is a Halicrafters S20R, which is a really nice boat anchor. Not in bad shape. Uh, you'll see the writing on the front is pretty good. Um, right here it's got some wear, but that's about it. Everything else is pretty straightforward. The thing I like about it, it has these aluminum sides to it. And um, dial's dirty and needs to be restored, obviously. Looks like it has all the original knobs. The tuning mechanism works. And taking a look top side, <coughs> it's the usual dirt. There's tubes missing, that type of thing. I haven't taken the back off to look underneath yet, but I assume it probably has all the old wax caps in it. 
and um, this is going to be something I restore as well. Um, so that's the three projects that I've got that I can start working on in a series. And I'm interested to know which ones you guys want to see. If you, uh, if you choose one and there's a unanimous vote, that's the one I'll build a series on. Um, <clears throat> the reason why I'm working on a radio is I just use the radio for my transmitter. And my rule is if I destroy a radio, I restore another one to make up for it. So that's why I've got a couple of radios here to work on. So um, if you guys can let me know what you want to see, I'll be happy to do it. Also, don't mind my voice here. Uh, I've got a little frog in my throat. Not sure why, but it's cool. Um, I was away last week, and I'm going to be away next week, but I'm going to start working on this stuff uh, you know, this weekend, obviously. I hope everybody's doing really well, and um, I'm just catching up on all your videos. So if you haven't seen me around, I didn't forget about you. And uh, I'm going to put this up now, and if, you, uh, if you're interested in seeing one of these get worked on, let me know, and I'll be happy to make a little series out of it. All right? Take care, folks. This is Ron. So friends, that's the story for today. Let me know what you want to see, and I hope everybody's well. Just back from vacation. I'll check out the rest of your videos. Everybody have a great night. Thanks.